And welcome back to a Gator Snapper playthrough, Sekiro, Shadows Die Twice, where Gator Snapper triumphantly skipped over a hard boss fight and opted to fight the shitty boss fight. And, oh, actually, you know what? This is a little bit of, uh, Centipede long arm Giraffe Man, isn't it? Because, I mean, that looks like something on his back. I guess, oh, what? Nope, nope, I'm stupid. I'm an idiot. That's a cow head. <laughs> I don't know what a cow head's doing here. That's equally as strange, especially how it's, like, melted into the rock. But... I'm still stupid. All right. Well, you know what? That's fine. I'm I'm oftentimes stupid. I'm used to it. I can I can live with this. This is nothing new. What's over here? Oh, I see. They're grapple points for my convenience. Okay. Uh, ooh, and we got some things down here. What do we got? I hope I don't accidentally. Oh, this is where these weirdos are. Now, are those centipedes or are those more little giraffe men? Let's find out. I guess. No, they're, 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 or wait, did I say centipedes? I meant to say fucking geckos. Well, whatever, it's all fine. So good thing about these guys is because they're ground-based enemies. Hello. Well, they're ground-based enemies, so you can just fucking kill them instantly like that. They're uh, the shitty versions of the long-armed centipede, which I believe... <laughs> I'm burning! I'm burning bad! Oh, Lord, I'm burning. Okay. This is fine. I'm sh Sekiro's used to treatment like this. It's just like, I'm always on fire in my soul. Hold on, Sekiro. We'll, uh, we'll fix you. We got some wet grass. Eat that. There you go. Feel better? Nothing will ever make me feel better. Alright, well, you're fuck you're the life of the party, aren't you? Ooh, and a prayer bead. Damn, I'm fucking- Oh, that's right, I need to turn some of those in. Oh, I got something big. I guess it's just reacting to the prayer bead. I heard, like, the fucking- Oh. Oh, that must, must have been what I heard. Okay. It sounded like the fucking skeletons in Skyrim, and I was like, what the fuck am I- What am I- What am I hearing here? Oh, 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 oh. Okay, well, it wasn't gonna fall to death, but I was still like, oh, this would be bad. Alright, well, let's keep going through the fucking scary, scary caverns. Uh, I guess this way? I hope this isn't where I came from. Yeah, this looks, uh... That's a lot of geckos. That's a lot of geckos. Let's, uh, carefully... I mean, they're not... They don't care. They're reptiles. They don't have familial attachments. That would have been bad walking into all that. Oh, we got some more geckos. God damn. So many goddamn geckos. This is like a crime. Crime against nature. Killing the geckos. The geckos themselves are innocent of all things. Hello. Divine confetti. Oh. Never mind. No, I'm sorry, Gecko. I didn't mean to fuck with you. Alright, well, we'll leave one alive. Maybe it'll be okay. <laughs> I don't know. Poor little Geckos. Uh, shit. Now, where am I going? Going in this cave... Oh, you know what? I didn't have to go in here at all. I think the doorway... <laughs> there was a doorway I could have just gone through. It wasn't there. Oops. My bad. Alright, back way we came. We gotta go through the fucking narrow confines of that l little fucking path pathway. Yeah, I, I that was one of those rare situations where I stumbled my words up and I could have like saved it. I could have just said path, but I was like, no, wait, I wanted to say uh, passage. And then it's like, oh, well, it's just gonna sound stupid now. Fucking hell, where am I? Is this, uh, wait, shit. Oh god, this is as scary as actually being lost in a cave. Isn't this where, isn't this, this is, oh, what the fuck? God damn, why are there so many cow skulls in here? This is making it very difficult. I have no... Oh, wait. Oh, oh, I'm back here. Okay, we're good. That was almost scary. For a moment, for a moment, I was really concerned there. It's like, have I actually gotten lost in the caves? Yeah, so what I was supposed to do, instead of going through the fucking little tunnels, I'm supposed to just open this fuck Locked? Locked? Who has the key? Oh, it's a bitch, Snake Eyes Shirafuji, isn't it? Or actually, no. No. It. I don't think it is. No, I need to get the key from the fucking air. Oh, god damn it. All right. No sequence breaking this direction either, I guess. I just cleared out the space. Oh, man. Oh, well, that's still not too bad. I mean, it's about playing the game, right? It's about just doing these things. Yeah, whatever. Fuck it. Yeah, give me give me some my third prayer necklace. Look at all look at all that health I have. I'm so healthy now. Uh, and I guess I can acquire a two. Ooh, I could actually get a three skill. Is that Ichimonji? Oh, actually, what is this skill? Flowing what? Wait. Wait, what was this one? That was light, posture, and that's also... Oh, reduces the amount of posture taken when attacked. Recovers posture upon a death blow. I mean, I've got three. I might as well just do this one. Watch, I'm going to wind up regretting that. Oh, you know what that actually reminds me of? Because it's called Flowing Water and it's a fucking sword skill. I watched... I've been watching a lot of that... Actually, I binged all the episodes available of uh, Demon Slayer, which is so fucking good. It's uh, it's like fucking My Hero Academia, but with demon slaying in, in ancient Japan, I guess. So that was... It's a good show. It's actually really enjoyable. I liked it. Uh, the main character is shouty, but enjoyable. Uh, it's got, like... 
it's it's bordering on serious themes where it's like, oh, that sucks for him, but it's also like, oh well. I mean, everything's okay in the end for him, but I don't know. It's weird. At first, I thought when I first saw things for it, I thought it was like a vampire anime, but they're just called demons. It might be that thing of like, oh, in Western culture, they're called vampires, and here we just call them demons. They're just they're very vampire-y. That's what they come across as. They have the sharp teeth and they like eating people, which I guess sounds more zombie-esque, doesn't it? Eh, I don't know. Ooh, and actually, you know what? Instead of progressing plot like I kind of promised to do, I can also get the Divine Fan and get our good old friend What's-His-Face uh, to the children he wants to hang out with. So let's do that real quick, too. I'm, I'm fucking going all over the place in these episodes. It's because I'm just really curious about, like, doing things different from the order that I had normally done them. I'm like, uh, what happens if I do this at this time now? And I mean, I don't think too much will happen if I send Junichiro, whatever his name is, uh, to the place ahead of me. But I'm just curious about it, because it, it makes it different. And that's like, that's curious. That's what I like about these games. They're, they give you these opportunities where you can, like, kind of change how things can be. You can fucking, you can mess with time. I can mess with time so much, I didn't even talk to the guy over there yet. I'm just gonna go up to him when I have, like, the fucking sword of immortal killing, and he's just gonna be like, oh, fuck. Oh, I'm sorry, I've never met you before, but can you kill me? He's just like, yeah, fuck, yeah, I'll do it. I'm all about that life. Uh, so, let's see. I think he's in the first zone. Just quickly abduct him. He'll be, he won't be any the wiser, and everything will work out. It'll be great. He's gonna be super psyched about it, I'm sure. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> we'll see. I mean... It's it's his request. He doesn't know what's gonna happen. He doesn't know like if it's if it's a good thing or not. We won't know either until we see him again. It's okay. It seems it seems bad. It seems bad. But once you actually like talk with him about oh fuck, did I actually get the thing on this account? Have I talked to you even? Oh no. Okay, good. I have the white pinwheel. Thank God. I was like, no, I don't want to fucking do that. Uh huh. Sure, I can abduct you. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I do. Uh huh. That's what we do, I guess. Have ah, did, damn. Did I talk to the, I talked to this guy on camera? I'm sure. Like it was an episode that got. I don't know. That whole episode might have actually been one of the ones that didn't record. Oh man. Well, I'm skipping over his dialogue anyway. So we're just going to accept and spirit him away. Uh huh. Don't worry. Don't be afraid. This is completely okay. Get out of here. Maybe. Hiya. Don't worry. It's fine. And I also missed what your name was. I just abducted you without a second thought. Well, whatever. We're all good. Now we can go back to Ashina Castle and do some, like, plot-related things. Not what I meant to do. Mixing up controls again. Wonderful. All right. It'll be fine. We'll go back to the dilapidated temple. Actually, why am I going back to the dilapidated temple? I should, well, I guess because otherwise it would have been popping up like 10 feet back where I just was. I mean, it's still quicker than the other way. I'd have to have dropped down the cliff and ran all the way back into the place where the fucking statue was. That's a pain. Who wants to walk places? I just want to travel using my, my Buddha statue. God, that'd be so convenient. If I could just get a Buddha statue set up like in my house, one in work... And then one, uh, at, I guess my other job, but it's more of a place where I hang out. I would use that shit all the time, save so much gas. But the catch is you have to kill a Sekiro boss in order to use those areas. And I guess, it, like, God, at TJ Maxx, it would be like a fucking, it would be the Guardian Ape. That would suck terribly. And at the card shop, you know, at the card shop, it'd probably be the guy with the, uh, it'd be Long Arm Draft Centipede. Because that place is very small, and having to fight him in there with a bad camera would suck terribly. It's just like fighting him in the normal space, even though it only took me, like, two tries to get him. Alright, sorry, Emma. I'm not here to hang out. I know you miss me terribly, but I gotta go... go... Where am I going? Just Ashina Ash Castle? I can just go into the antechamber. I don't have to fight that guy to get his, his prayer bead. It's more of a fact of just knowing where they are. That's the important part. And I've been meaning to fucking go through this castle for a while now anyway, so... We'll just do that. Yep, skipping over boss enemies, as always. There's actually a mini-boss guy I want to fight in this castle, because he makes life a lot fucking easier if you're trying to fight, um... Genichiro. Everyone's name I've come up with in this game, it's been something Ichiro, hasn't it? When I don't remember their names, except I'm pretty sure his name is Genichiro. I just don't know what the big dude's name was, so we're just gonna call him Junichiro. It means, like something number one <laughs> yeah it means go go number one it's a very it's a it's a cheer name it's great 
Alright, and if I remember my Ashton of Castle, I gotta stealth around assassinating people. Because fuck fighting these guys in a head-on fight. They're they're hard mini enemies. Like they're they're not the worst, I guess. Like there's harder enemies, but they are still a pain in the ass. Oh, and this one is one that has two. Oh man. Alright, we're gonna have to be super stealthy. Unless my game crashes. No, no, we're good. Oh, fuck, and you know what? With that lag spike. This is a good time to fucking talk about it. It's as good of a time as any, I suppose. There's been a weird thing happening when I've written, been recording on my new OBS software. If the uh, if OBS lags too hard, it fucks with Audacity and it like messes with um, uh, it like skips uh, it skips it skips in the audio recording. It really annoys me because then I have to do some like edits at that point. Because it also fucks with the time sync as well. Because it like you just it just loses uh, it just loses like fucking audio. It's a pain in the ass. I don't really know how to prevent it or anything, but oh, whatever. We're just gonna kill old ladies in the process. So just know that if there's been a weird skip, I have to stop talking anytime there's a lag spike because it's a potential explanation moment. Yeah, I might have to, uh, like, fucking skip, um... Okay, good. Uh, yeah, there might be weird edits to uh, accommodate the fact that there's been, like, random, like, cuts in the audio outside of my control. Uh, and you know what? There's another prosthetic tool I can get while I'm here. I can also open up some shortcuts. If I just jump down here, I believe. Is that guy? Is that guy down here? There's like a guy that's chained up. He might not be down here. Better to get the item now rather than later if that is the case. Uh, it's just two small guys, isn't it? Whoa! Oh! Hey, everybody. That was a terrible error on my part. I'm just gonna... Hold on. Where's the thing? Hold on, guys. Hey! Hey! Uh, it's okay. I'm all good. I just want to collect some items, guys. Don't mind me, I'm here for my prosthetic tools. You are denying me my rights to use prosthetic arms, and that offends me. Oh, and this guy's just got that fucking slow walk up. Alright. Fuck off, I just won Sabi Maru. It's a nice little poison blade, you guys won't understand. Oh, and I can open up shortcuts while I'm at it. Don't mind me, everybody, I'm just opening doors. You cannot affect me while I'm opening doors. Now let me open up the other door that's behind y'all. Okay, excuse me. Oh my god, that's such a perfect little hop. Alright, oh, there's another one in here, wow, alright. Oh, wait, if I open up this door, that's right behind Big Boy. Well, let's do it anyways, it'll be funny. I mean, I have to run through here anyways. Got a fucking... Guy, is he still giving the speech, I wonder? Oh, I could actually assassinate him, take a health bar off? I mean, there's another way to do it, so I'm not too worried. And actually, it will be quicker if I just go through the door over here. Where'd everyone else go? I guess we're just in here. Don't mind me yet again! Oh, you guys are blocking the door, it's rude as shit! Boy, haha. <laughs> made it just in the nick of time now i gotta go f oh god where do i go actually i want to go into the i want to hit a fucking buddha statue but uh, i gotta make sure no one spots me um they're i'm gonna get spotted what oh god the lag spikes too god so much audio is probably getting fucking lost right here if the lag spike thing works like i'm thinking it does hold on let me just go over here for a little bit and i guess I actually why didn't i just buddha statue last commune idol don't mind me everybody I just have to assassinate a couple of samurai yet again, but it shouldn't be that hard. I mean, shouldn't be is the key word, but we know with me, I can make anything difficult. It's just a matter of how you approach the situation, and with the mindset you approach it. And mine is always underestimating. Alright, now let's see. Uh, I could also just sprint to where I want to go. That's been my key solution to everything. Just sprint. Go fast. It's gotta go fast, but nah. We'll go fast, but also kill people in the process. God, the lag spikes are fucking frequent. God, that's gonna be the new fucking problem in my head, isn't it? Like, the fucking lag spikes, uh, cutting out audio. That's gonna be the new challenge I have to fucking circumvent. It's just non-stop with recording. Like, I swear, there's always a new problem to have to take care of. Uh, and I'm not gonna open that door. That's too much trouble. We're gonna go in through the ceiling, because that's the better option. It's safer that way. Ceilings are God's way for ninjas to get into life without trouble. Uh, let's see. If it's actually... God, can I take on two of them? You know what? Let's make sure it's only two of them. I'll kill this guy. Because there's a there's another prayer bead or something. Oh, that's what I hit. Oh, I didn't even realize. Alright, yeah, that's having to grab some attention. Okay, two samurais. I should have fucking firecrackers out. Maybe I can assassinate one of them. It is just two, right? Oh, God. I have to assassinate the easier one to fight in person. Alright, let's do it. Alright, here we go. I can take one samurai. It's just they have like a thrust attack that's very... That one. That attack is kind of hard for me to counteract against here. But I'll just do this, and I'll give him my own fucking... He has an Ichimonji attack, that's right. We're just gonna show him what for! Ichimonji! Can't fucking handle that, can you? Oh, there it is. 
Oh my god. And that, that one of the things I've noticed is um it feels like oh god. It feels like um maybe it's like a later game thing if you upgrade the skills. Oh yeah. Uh, uh, oh, and he's recovering posture. I'm not too worried. I'll just firecracker him. There you go, you fucking asshole. They're tanky, too. That's another problem. Oh, oh, God. I could have sworn, like, you have to hit LBB to do the, uh, the Makiri counter. But later in the game, I was able to just, like, hit B, dash into their attack, and that would work for the counter. I don't know what's up with that. And honestly, I don't know where that conversation was really going. But more importantly, we're going to go knock priceless artifacts over but we're also gonna hug this this happy looking man look at him just having a good old time let's give him a hug a backwards hug though yeah and he he, he rewards us for his his i don't know his need for a hug and we get a prayer bead i believe unless it's a prosthetic like a prosthetic tool i don't remember where i got it from no it's a prayer bead i have two in my possession wow that's a lot of prayer beads that's a lot of prayer I'm gonna be doing. Or a lot of beads I'm gonna stick into someone's ass. It's a good fucking time, ain't it? Alright, here we go. Into the ceiling. God's way for ninjas to do whatever the fuck I said it was before. Uh, let's see. I think... Ugh. The next room is somewhere I probably just want to run past. God knows I don't want to fight too many fucking samurai. God, if only I had... Oh, wait, no, I have uh, ceramic shards. Can I get both of their attention? Because I really want to get... The, those fucking samurais are a pain in my ass. Actually, I could just throw it at him. He's like, what the fuck? Yeah, now he just needs to come over here where I can drop on him. And just him. Just... Fucking asshole. Fuck it. Get over here. Fucking damn it. Shit. Get over here. Fucking come here. I'm gonna throw another one at him. Fuck you. God, it's gotta be so fuck. How stupid do you have to be, though, in this situation? It's like, fucking what the shit? Who's throwing ceramic at me? He's coming from an upwards trajectory as well. Ooh, well, this might actually work in my favor. If this asshole would just fucking... What, <sighs> what an asshole. Alright, you know what? Fuck it. I'm done. Fuck you. I'm gonna drop some fucking... Oh, uh, uh, oh, no. Okay, this is fine. This is fine. You know what? I should actually kill the minor enemy first, because... Ooh, kill the aggros. Oh, that's not a healing item. Alright, this is fine. Uh, Bob, Bob, just barely. Oh, oh, good. Oh, no. That's way too many. That is way too many to deal with. Excuse me, sir. Oh, I'm just gonna run past y'all. I have something I'd like to collect real quick. Uh, uh, there it is. I need to pray real fast. There we go. And that's better. Ugh. Yeah. Dealing with three of those samurai in one fucking go. Not a good time. And I'm actually... This is where I want to go, because I use this room up ahead as a shortcut. We just have to kill a mini-boss. I did not actually rest, did I? Oops. Hold on, guys. Let me reset your aggression levels. There you go. There you go. Now you're completely unaware of my existence. Okay, they the things weren't disappearing, and I was a little concerned. I was like, my god, <laughs> they're able to beat my King Crimson. Alright, nice JoJo reference. Anyways, uh-huh. What man? I don't see who we're talking about. I think they're actually talking about the guy I was talking about, giving him a sword and killing him. Yeah, immortality. It's a great power. Oof. Terrible. Don't like it. That's a shit ability. Uh huh. Is crawling. Is crawling with parasites. It's gross. Well, that makes you a very smart kid. Pat him on the head and tell him good job. Well, alright. I guess. I'm nearly out of time for this episode. Going down there sounds like a pain in the ass. I guess let's just, uh, we'll showcase this next boss. I'll probably die in two minutes, or less, so there's no need to worry about going overtime. There he is, this asshole. Looks like any ordinary samurai, but in fact, he's a big pain in my ass. Originally, my method of beating him was just to dash past this shitty fucking one-shot movie, like, spams over and over again. But apparently, uh, parrying is also a good option. I don't know, we'll have to see. See, that's what I do, and it feels easier for me, so I might just do that in this fight. I also got Firecracker's most OP ninja weapon uh, in the fucking game, I've come to realize. Oof, oof, and he's taking damage pretty uh, pretty well, which in Gator Snapper terms means it's going to be easy to kill him. Oh, he's, he's uh, yeah, no, this is, this is going to go great. Hold on, hold on, let me drink, let me drink. Haha. -ha. Yeah, see, I think this works better in my eyes. This is a better method for me. And he takes, yeah, he's dying quick. This should be fine. Yeah, see, just a dash and a hit and a dash back. And this room actually has space in it. You fight another guy with red eyes, and he's a pain in the ass. I hate fighting that guy, because you fight him in a narrow hallway. Oh, he's tricking me up. Ooh. 
You tricky bitch. I'll show you. Do it again. Hiya! Haha, <laughs> he hasn't learned my strategy yet. Which is very stupid, but whatever works, right? Alright, come on, come at me. Ha ha ha! And now I will fucking stab you like this, and you should be dead, but you are not. Then I'll do that. Get some. <laughs> oh. Alright, alright. Well, we're both on it. We're, uh, uh. we're about to both be on our second lives, I can see. Ooh, that should have hit me in all fairness. But, ow! Alright, you know what? I'm not gonna be fair with you, old man. I'm just gonna be a fucking punk ass dick all the time. Oh, yeah, this is a lot easier, especially compared to the other fucking version of this guy you fight. I mean, it's not the same guy. Oh, yeah. Fucking falling for it. Falling for his shenanigans. All right. You, I gotta drink fucking potions quick. Oh, no. Is he getting faster or am I just getting stupider? All right. Hold on. Hold on. Let me, let me center myself. Both my soul and my position in the room. My feng shui. Ha ha, bitch. And you know what? It never hurts to throw up firecrackers until it doesn't work. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Ooh, hi, okay. Okay, all right, we're gonna step back a little bit. Uh, maybe just, oh. Uh, all right, here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh no, oh no. <laughs> He's trying to trick me. He's trying to make me fall into a parry. Oh, but it don't matter because I'm too good. Fuck you, old man. You're not so elite anymore now that you're dead. <laughs> good fucking comeback, me. And I guess on that note, I can collect this item and end the episode right here. Well, you know, let's read the thing, too. Ghost once lurked the lands of Ashina. The ghost lightning was of the fountainhead gods, unstoppable by normal means. Avoid ground reverse the lightning. Yep, that's a great poem. It'll become relevant soon enough. Oh, well, there we go. You can... You can reverse lightning. Anyways, on that note, I'm going to end this episode right here. So this has been a Gator Snapper playthrough. See you guys in the next one. Later, everybody.